not the grand final set. It's the set before that. It's yeah. the the winners final set. Or Loser's not final winners finals. Loser. It's winners semis. I winners think. Winners semis. Yeah. Okay. So you need to watch that, guys. Mango goes in with his uh, with his Falco a whole bunch. Or sorry, he goes in with his Fox like a whole lot, and then uh. Muji King just gets some insane gimps yeah. and clutches out all three games. All three games, it's like Man. the very end of it is just some crazy gimp that happens. And they all of a sudden, even. all of a sudden, the M2K show yeah. turns on. We live. Uh, here, though, this is the match we were uh, oh my talking God, about a second dude. ago. Johnny S2J, versus Homemade Waffles. Homemade Waffles, and S2J is moving like a madman right now. Yeah. And you he know, does, he does some stuff with Falcon that, like, no other Falcon makes work. Yeah, yeah. Like, some of the options he chooses works because he's S2J. Yeah. He's, uh, he's a he, madman. He knows where to do it, when to do it. He's a madman. How to make it happen. Guys, at Revelator with S2J versus Revelation. Lucky, I think it was Revelator. Revelator? I'm going to say Revelator. I, thought, I, thought it was, I think it's Revelation. Okay, either way, at that tournament, S2J versus Lucky in set two. Lucky SDs and S2J throws away his stock yeah. in game five set two. Yeah. That is crazy. He's a legend. But, you know, as much as I actually love to watch S2J play, as a fellow Brandon, I'm going to be rooting yeah. for homemade waffles here. This is my, uh, and, you know, I was hanging out with him a little bit at Alex's house. He's a, he's a true homie. Haven't yeah. got to meet Johnny yet, but... You know, hopefully Brennan can make some stuff happen. And uh, Homemade Waffles playing Fox in this matchup, which is interesting because yeah. uh, notably, you know, known for playing Falco, right? Yeah. Uh, he's been playing Fox a lot more recently. But Falco in this matchup is so gross Falco that wins this matchup hard. What is the... Oh, my God. Johnny. Johnny. Okay. Woo. Uh, Dude, did you see what Waffles did right there? No. He did uh, Shine Nair. Drill reset shine. That was crazy, dude. It was Ooh, wild. Nice little rising nair off the stage Waffles to get that back. In the first stock, let's go. Let's go, young Waff. He's okay. like, he's like, Johnny's keeping him on the edge here. He's like, guys, what if I make top eight? How am I gonna commentate? <laughs> yeah, we'll just have to do the uh, the we'll do the I'm the playing Evo so good right now, or we'll have to do the uh, the Apex 2013 <laughs> or whatever, whichever tournament it was. Yeah. self commentary. We'll have to bring that back. Press one if you feel bad for him. You know. <laughs> Oh, oh, drops on knee. No, no, he goes for he the up there. And gets caught by the side B. S2J, come on. We know you're better than that. Oh, okay. The side B's Both of the, the shield. That's all of them. Good. All the shields wow. getting up in time. But that was a really quick stomp knee by The S2J. gospel of S2J may all down airs lead to knee. Yeah. Got the disciples of S2J back in California. Hopefully they're uh, reciting the gospel. <laughs> Oh wow, the first hit Nair into jab, that would have been really nice if he could set that up. I love how they're not dash dancing on opposite sides of the stage. No, they're dash dancing like close to each other right now. They're both so fast that they can go from the opposite side of the stage right next to each other in, in an instant, yeah. right? And uh, and kind of just catch, e catch each other off guard. For sure. But instead they're just staying right next to each other and uh, putting out moves, getting their shields up. Perfectly. Yeah. Every, every time these shields are amazing right now. Homie Waffles barely misses that edge guard there. And he sticky Ooh. walks a little bit. He's swagging out. He's having fun. He's Let's see feeling what himself. Can do. He, he Falcon kicked out of the corner there, but didn't really confirm anything off of it. Super late up air. Shout out to Scar. Nice. Oh my yeah, god. So Waffles tried to uh, spot dodge the aerial, but it was so late in fact. Yeah. That he was able to grab the spot dodge <laughs> after missing the aerial. Yeah, nice little forward smash there. That's the uh that's the classic Falcon edge guard, man. Just do the forward smash. Force them below the stage, and if you can forward smash them while they're coming back up, the hitbox dips pretty low. It's yeah. Good. It, if they're below the stage, F smash works all the time. Yeah. Uh, if, like, they're, if they're above the stage, sometimes uh, they get behind you and you miss. Dude, which always Homemade Waffles bad. is just throwing out aerials all over the place, and Johnny can't get out. All right, there we go. He makes it back to center stage safely. He's reading a bunch of stuff, and Homie Waffles is just running away. Oh, that's oh. gonna be the up air, yeah. Johnny Edgeguard something. Yeah. Well done. <laughs> maybe, uh, maybe, maybe he'll finally pick up on those. There's a lot of uh, new Wizro footage of yeah. no, crazy edgeguarding. SJJ's gotten a lot better edgeguarding lately. I know this is the meme. We need to let it die, guys. If I would, if I was SJJ, I would be. Annoyed at this point. Have you heard about top player edge guard percentages? No. And like, actually. uh, like finishing the edge guard off, like, uh, -uh. Fi uh, completing it and taking the stock. 
apparently Wizrobe has the highest percent of uh, like completed edge guards that doesn't out of surprise all top players. It's like 80 percent of that his edge guards end up working and taking it, taking a stock. Homemade Waffles DI's away the down throw because he's not about to get down throw. Or yeah, he's not gonna get drop zone knee yeah. here. Yeah, drop zone knee on Yoshi's though. Like you're playing a real dangerous game. You yeah. might you, you're likely to kill yourself on this stage. Yeah. If, uh, if you're just if you a drop frame off. Yeah, yeah. Or if you accidentally fat fall. Yep. And then another thing that happens is, is like if you're the person getting drop zone need, if you smash the eye in hard enough, you can get the the reverse knee hitbox and you can tech off the wall and you can actually survive it. So sometimes people actually like to DI super hard in on this stage, but that was some insane movement by SJ. That was beautiful. That was beautiful. Okay, they're just feeling each other out a little bit. Oh, he goes for the dash attack up smash. Yeah. Oh, okay. He, he goes almost, back. Almost, yeah. almost made it to Randall. He tries to fade back to Randall, but Randall's just a little bit out of reach. Nice ledge dash. Full jump down airs. He's going to stuff these these approaching airs. So, Falcon's moves, like, if they are not spaced 100% perfectly, they're not safe. Like, yeah. on shield and stuff. No, like Very few of them are. But S2J is literally spacing every single aerial he does immaculately. Nicely done. He's a top, top player, dude. His spacing is godlike. And his neutral, you know, S2J is renowned for having one of the best neutrals in the game. But Homemade Waffles is doing a surprisingly good job keeping up holding, with it right now. Holding his own for sure. Absolutely. He's not getting hit by just, like, you know, approaching nares and stuff and, like, just the, the, the classic Falcon edge guards and, like, the Johnny stuff that he does. Homemade Waffles is playing real smart right now. Man, I hate it when uh, when you dare shine, but they smash the eye out of your dare, and then you, you shine, shine, so up. you end up getting grabbed. Yeah, yeah, that's mm. some, some top-level stuff. Happened to Waffles there just a nice moment ago. Nice shine grab. Up air is going to kill wow. on Yoshi's. Okay. Even with the uh, heavy weight from Falcon and the fact that he is a fast faller, Yoshi's uh, helping secure that kill for Ooh. Homemade Waffles. The very end Keeping of his it second hit in air. Two stocks to two stocks. Ooh, wow, he crouch canceled it. Was that the second hit of up air that connected? I think it was only the second hit. Yeah. Yeah. He was able to crouch cancel it. He just crouch canceled. What did he do there? You can't crouch cancel down air. How no, did he get that no. grab? Uh so nice either, tech. That grab happened either because Waffles missed an L cancel. Or he was a little bit or, late on the shine, maybe. Yeah. Or um sometimes like nice. The the hitboxes are weird and you miss like the last one the last or two. Hit and, yeah, like they don't okay. get they don't actually activate. Okay. And uh, and so people can get a grab out. Crowd's getting a little bit hyped that uh, down tilt pop up into shine was pretty good by homemade waffles. I love it when people moonwalk in the middle of like a real set. That's my favorite thing. Forward ever. throw and just cover the options. Ledge cancel, but it's he covers it. And, and it was a soft back, back air. Hits. Soft back air, no tech, up smash. We're one stock to one stock. Come on, homemade waffles, let's see what you can do. Done a great job Whoa, so far. Oh my gosh! Was... Okay, SJ rolls out of the pressure there. This this matchup can be who gets what started first. You know, yeah. is and it Johnny gets is a knockdown? Straight oh aerials, my gosh. or is it the nice? Is he going down? Launcher yeah. from Fox. Johnny's got the pressure started on Homie Walsh's shield. They make it back out to neutral, and a uh, uh, straight F tilt. Oh my god! Oh wow, that's a smart get up there. That get up attack was phenomenal. Yeah. And you know, covering covering angles like that is Look hard. at that, that man. Was, that was clean. Covering covering people going to ledge, like, you see that work so much. Yeah. But notice today how little it's actually worked. Yeah. People are covering that ledge real nice. Yep.